we can load embeddings from our local machine i have saved it in this folder new chroma dv i'm going to load it from here then use it to query my data instead of creating new embeddings first i will import chroma dv import chroma dv then i'm going to import vector store index from llama index dot core import vector index or vector store index then from llama index dot vector stores dot chroma import chroma vector store and then from llama underscore index dot core import storage context now i'm going to initialize the chroma db client i will make a variable db db stands for database then chroma db and from this module i will call the method persistent client so this model will load the embeddings from our local machine and now i have to give the path and so path is going to be in double quotes i will draw it dot slash and then the name of this folder new underscore chroma underscore db i will write it here new underscore chroma underscore db once we load this embeddings we need to create collections out of it i will make a new variable chroma underscore collection and then i will call this database and from this i will call the method get or create collection and inside this i will give a name let's say i will give a name quick start to this collection here and then let us execute our code now we have to assign this chroma as the vector store to the context so i'm going to create a variable vector underscore store and then i will call this chroma vector store inside this i will call chroma underscore collection and then i will pass this chroma collection so i will assign this one instance and then i will create a storage context storage underscore context then i will call the class storage context from this i will call the method from underscore defaults and inside this i will pass our vector store and this is going to be vector store that we have just created here let us execute our code next we will load index from store index or store vectors i will make a variable index and then i will call vector store index i will call the method from vector store and then first i will pass vector store then the next is storage underscore context is equal to storage underscore context and then embed underscore model is equal to local let us execute our code so now we will have index here or the indexing in this variable index we need to load our or we need to create our LLM model I will import here import OS from get pass import get pass and then get pass I have to write here double S then I will create hugging face token so i will write here hf underscore token 
is equal to get pass and then let us execute our code i'll copy my api key from here and then i will paste it here now i'm going to create an llm model and before that i need to import hugging face inference api i will write here from llama index dot llms dot hugging face import hugging face inference api and then llm is going to be hugging face inference api model name the first parameter is model underscore name and here i am going to pass this mixed rail model i will copy it from here and then paste it here and then token is equal to hf token and let's print our llm model so this is our llm model that we are going to use and we have already created or loaded indexing now let me import vector store index and simple directory uh, just the simple directory not vector store index i will write here from llama index dot core import vector store index and simple directory reader now i'm going to load my documents i will make a variable documents and then i will call this simple directory reader and then input file is equal to paul underscore sa dot txt dot load underscore data and then i will print these documents here so here in the output you can see the document this is an essay written by paul now we will create uh, so we will create a uh, index of this document here and let's do that i will write here index and then vector store index from documents then i will pass here our documents then embed underscore model is equal to local now let's create our query engine so we have this index here i will make a variable query underscore engine then index dot as query engine inside this i will pass llm is equal to llm then i will make a variable response and then i will call this query engine dot query and i will ask a question what is the essay about now let's print our response what output we get so i got some error here is too large to be loaded automatically okay so let's change our mistral model i will select a different one so i will write here mistral but this time i will choose this 8 into 7 million parameter earlier i chose 8 into 22 billions i will select this one i will copy it from here and then i will paste it here and let me execute this code again and this time we should not get any error here
so it is taking some time let's wait a minute and we got the output here this is about Paul Graham's experience with working on different projects including writing and programming and how he discovered the power of publishing essays online he discussed how he started writing essays in the print era era but it wasn't until he started publishing them online that he realized their potential and so on so we got the correct output uh, so we have seen how we can load the embeddings from uh, our folder so here we have loaded this embeddings uh, in this variable index however we have not used uh, that embedding we have created uh, one new one for this document but we can also use this embeddings but the goal was to show you how you can load these embeddings from your uh, saved embeddings folder i hope you enjoyed this video if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel thank you for watching